All right, so here we are inside of the Fort Newgrad prison. Lydia just giving this, giving us the old stare down. And this dude needs some skooma. Too bad he won't get it ever. All right, let's let's throw down. The mage. Take care of this guy first. Nope. There's someone else? Oh, there is. Where are you at? Must be down there. Oh, didn't want the stupid antlers. What am I going to do? Put them on my own head? Uh, ingredients, I think. Yeah. Gold ingot? Hell yeah. Where is this guy? Where is this clown? Show yourself. Tell you what. You start running so I can stand with the back. So it's Khajiit. Oh, there he is. What are you doing over there, man? You okay? <laughs> Lydia, you totally whiffed that. I guess he's stuck in that pile of wood. Oh, okay, he's out. Zapping him in the booty. <laughs> firewood. I guess he was weighed down with firewood and couldn't move. Who's going first? Oh, version of the shock. Ooh. There's that weird synergy junk again. Well, I guess I need one more skill level up and I will be level 10. Yes. Oh, hell yeah. It's a wine cellar. Oh. Oh. Okay. Anything down here? Oh, two Skyrim, okay. Ugh, Charis. Hate those damn things. Bites with its razor, sharp mandibles. Mandibles. Oh, so close to level 10. So close yet so far. Hello. Oh, so we're just out in the back in the poopy sewer water. That's just great. There's Lydia. Okay, how far to Falkreath? Wow. All right. Back through Helgen. It's kind of a walky back path. Whoa, what's this over here? It's like a path up to some chests or something. Oh, up to some gold ore. Cool. Alright, I guess there's two things of them. Let's go ahead and get that. Um, pickaxe. Oh, wait. Oh, okay. Not bad, and that reminds me. Um, returns me.
Wow, really? That was pretty lucky. But I definitely, definitely am not complaining. More Magicka. Yes, please. Augmented Shock, level 1. Shock spells do 15% more damage and you gain 15% shock resistance. Yes. Lydia leveling up. Leveling up. Cool. Back to Falkreath we go. And if you're wondering why I chose Falkreath to be the second place where I become Thane, and it's because, well, I mentioned before that Falkreath is my favorite area in the game, or the, my favorite hold. Is this the right way? Yes. My favorite hold. And, um, <clears throat> the house car you get is also my second favorite, or probably up there with Lydia. So I guess tied for first with my favorite. Oh no, she's just pretty cool. And there you have it. That's the reason why. And I also plan on building my house there in the Falkreath area uh, with the Hearthfire add-on DLC. So that's a thing. Already back to Helgen. Felt like it was a longer trip up there than it was back. <clears throat> but I think it's always that way with everything. Three heads on the same spike, is that really necessary? Didn't I get all this stuff already and kill these people? What the hell? Lydia, where are you at? Oh, gall. Oh, Lydia's right there. Oh. And she flies in the opposite direction. That's just great. Wow, look at that death pose. Right up against the building, too. Hooray! There's another dude up there. I thought I killed all these people already. Well, if they want to respawn all this stuff for me, I'm okay with that. You call yourself a sword? Let's go zap this dude up here. Come on, get, get just scoot over a little bit more. Scoot over. <laughs> we all the way down with you. Oh, magic potion. Oh, really? Come on. There we go. And back to Falkreath. Oh, I should give her my arrows. Stop, stop, stop. I'm right behind you. Yeah, she's down to seven iron arrows. There you go. Lead on. Kind of surprised I haven't fought a random dragon, aside from the one all the way back at White Run a few episodes ago. I remember there was one who was kind of. 
Is that a bear trap? Really? Did I just hear one? I know I heard a bear trap, but I thought I just heard a dragon too. Oh, I did. Uh-oh. Is this one actually gonna, you know, come at me, bro, or is he just gonna fly around too? There was one a few episodes ago who did that, just flied around, flew around, didn't even care. Oh, missed. Oh, fine, be like that. Didn't I discover this place too? What the hell? This is like this weird cabin thing, right? Pine watch. Yeah, what the piss? Lydia, where you at? Let's see what this is all about. Oh. Ah. Come on. Really? There we go. What's gonna be inside? Nobody knows. What's behind door number one? Bring it on! Hopefully it's not some kind of crazy master wizard dude who's just chilling in here. Still here. It's playing the dungeon music. Oh, oh boy. Well, that guy fails. Lydia didn't even notice. <laughs> oh, that doesn't look suspicious. Oops, steal the gold. Guess I'll steal the gold. Note to Rorlack. We got the right cart this time. The note has been sent and we'll see how they respond. In the meantime, we'll keep breaking down this stuff. You keep sailing off the wood to keep our front. If we can get a good price for the mold, we should be set for a while. Oh, and we left some wine for you in the bucket behind the shelf. Consider it a bonus. Wriggle Rig strong arm. Okay. I guess I'll take the gold. Let's see what this is all about. Button. Press that. Random bucket. Oops. Stole the bucket. Did not want the bucket, but I stole the bucket. Get out of here. Whoa, wine's going crazy. If this is a huge dungeon, I am going to end the episode after I exit here. It's taking a while to get out. It's a bandit dude. Ray, I can actually take care of myself somewhat against regular bandits. Okay, it's not as impressive as I thought it was. Is that chest down there? Indeed it is. Oh. It's got level 28 lockpicking. Potions galore. A drought of strength should draw a good price. Whoa! God, what the hell is going on? Get out of my face! Asshole. this. Oh, barred from the other side, okay. I want to get that chest down there. So there's two ways to go. What the fuck?
Oh, so I'm down here where the chest is. Oh, come on, give me a break. My cabbages! Ugh. Some kind of weird trap thing. No, oh, don't push me onto that, for God's sakes. I'm trying to see if there's anything down there. Health potion, coin purse. And a way out. I'm assuming I can get there. A different way. Huh. <clears throat> what would you do for a Klondike bar? I would explore this dungeon, apparently. There's one dude, there's two dudes. Time to go ham. One down, one to go. Come at me, brah. Oh, there's another one. Really, Lydia? Really? There's someone else with the bow and arrow. There he is. Oh, there's two bandit outlaws. Ugh. Look at this ghetto bridge made of like three different things. Or a ramp. I need a jogger. Come on, there we go. You guys have fun with that. Where you at? Death from above, sucker. Yeah. know about that. Oh, chest. Aha. Uh -huh. Trying to be sneaky. Oh, fuck you. Bandit thug? I don't I don't know what that means, so gall. It means he's pretty strong. I'm gonna go hide up here. I got in a few good hits. Do your worst.
Yeah! Man, there must be something really damn good down here. Pine Watch Bandits Sanctuary. I don't remember anything like this. <clears throat> Pine Watch Bandit Sanctuary. We're probably all down here just playing video games and stuff. Couches everywhere, TVs, Cheeto bags, and junk. <laughs> yeah, I'm definitely going to end the episode at the end of this dungeon. And next time I will get back to Falkreath. Is this a door? No. Did you hear something? No. Wow, why'd she have to move? Bitch. Well, now she's dead. Oh, my Draugr got rocked. I, fought worse than you. I need like a dagger or something for when I'm... don't have any magic. Do I have one? Yeah, I do. Ugh, poke, poke, poke. I don't really want to get that close to that giant warhammer thing. Is there another dude back here? Oh, there is. Ow. This one must be a high level one as well. Yeah, bound it out. Bound it out long. Well, none of that. Really? Rosro's letter. Check that out in a second. Are these skill books? No. I love how he bangs his dagger against his own arm. Alright, what's this Roz Roz letter business? Come on, it won't be that bad. Rickle may be paranoid, but she's as dumb as a mammoth. Body hair like one, too. Treasure room. Okay, so there's a treasure room somewhere. Bandit. Let's reward. Nothing. No skill books, really? Stupid books. What's the point if they don't give me a skill level up? So, treasure room. This interests me. Yes. Expert, wow. What was that? No. That's it. No fuck. Oh, come. Get the fuck out of here. There we go. Ugh! 
Unleash the beast. Beasting all over these fools. This guy's already dead for some reason. I'm okay with that. Oh god. Oh god, oh man. There's someone a dragger behind him. Oops. Ray. Now you're gonna get it. Really? God, that's so annoying. Son of a. Zap. Seven gold. Wow. Hey, look, Dragger, it's your buddies. What's this? Whoa. Oh, well, that was easy. Wish it was more like that. I like that more often. Oh, God, I'm not taking that. Because it sits in your inventory forever. Oh! Ugh. Ugh, that scared me. If you take an unusual gem, the quest and the items sit there forever until you actually find all of them. And there's no quest markers for um, the unusual gems. Maybe I'll try and do that later, but I don't feel like doing it now. Like later in the series, if I've done pretty much everything else. Get out of my way. Sleeping in there. Move. Yes, I know that. Oh, they heard that. Tracker goes first. Go. Go, Lydia. Go, Lydia. Go, Lydia. Go. Bandit outlaw. Regular bandit. I'll kill the regular bandit. Wow. Freaking party of bandits in here. Where's the regular bandit? Outlaw, outlaw, bandit. There we go. I think the rest are outlaws, yeah. This is gonna take a while. Scrolls, what do I have? Conjure Storm Matronac, what do you know about that? I think I'm gonna do that. Get him, Storm Matronac! Yeah! Whoa, that was pretty cool. Oh, man, Atronach's going ham. Wow, crap. <laughs> she shot straight up like a rocket. Oops, I'm getting in the way. Come on, man. Your aim is almost as bad as mine. Yeah. Wow, I'd say using that scroll was pretty worth it. Just a pile of old bodies here. Any 
Anything in here worth getting? Read warning. Whoa. You've all been warned about trying to break into my treasure rooms, but Roars didn't think I was serious. Now he's dead. You've all had your cut of the take. Blah, blah, blah. Cool. Cool story, bro. I loot you. Yeah, you. Oh. Yep. Alright, you're gonna get some of this treasure. Ooh. Itchy nose. She said something about traps. He's gonna alert somebody? Oh god. Whoops, accidentally hit the microphone. Riddle strong arm. Great. Drop that. God knows if I need to start running. Uh, what did I take that was... Yeah, that's stupid. You call yourself a Easily God, I'm such a sorry excuse for a mage. Die. Thank you. Sounds like that's the end of that. Soul gem. Yeah. Nice. That'd be totally just troll mode if there's a trap behind that door. Oh! I've got a bad feeling about there's a trap this. behind this one, though. Huh. Oh, God. Swinging blade trap. Huh. Don't push me into this. Jesus. Ah, it's one of these things. And there's another one here. Huh. Did I do it? <laughs> Dragger in here. A dead one. Ah, another trap. Just making sure there's nothing else in here worth getting. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. Hooray! Look at all this good stuff. Oh crap, I think I'm close to my care. Up. Oh. oh yeah. Lydia. I've got your Open back. your backpack. Um take that, that. Uh, that, that should be plenty. That was like 50 weight things. Yeah! There's no sound better than this sound. Curious silver mold. Silver candlestick. 
Leather bracers. Fire rune. Cool. Culio, do I have a necklace equipped? Amulet of Talos. I think I'll do this one. The more health, the better. Oh, pine watch. Oh, man. What a freaking huge episode. I've been... I recorded three episodes back to back today, so I am getting pretty tired. And you'd be surprised how strenuous doing commentary videos are on your voice. Like, you wouldn't think it because it's just talking, but. Ugh, talking for so long. Oh, good thing I have a drink here. Because, man. Ah, uh, here's the bar door. This is the way out, I think. Let me out! Let me out! Oh! Read warning. Wow, really? That's the same warning? I didn't want that. Get out. Now, how close is this to Falkreath? I might just make the rest of the journey. Friends of the Arles and Falkreath, Hjalmarch and Nepal may buy land in those holds and build their own home on it. And that's what I plan on doing in the Falkreath hold. Because I like Falkreath. It's, it's a good looking area. I haven't even... I've built a house here twice. Never even touched the other two holds because I just don't think they're comparable to Valkyrie. This is the building table where you add on sections to your house. Ugh. I'm right behind. Man, how close am I? Fuck it. Let's just get the Valkyrie. Thank you for sticking around if anyone is still here. I know this is a super episode of mega super victory win awesome, but I mean, I'm so close. Get out of my way, elk, or I will zap you. Don't test me. That's right, you better turn around. <laughs> What do you do? Launch that boulder at me when when I turn my back on him? You jerk. Ooh, finally in the home stretch. I'm gonna finish recording this episode and get me something to eat. I'm hungry. But I'm always hungry. What is going on over here? What? Fuck! I am waiting for a good death. Did you... Did you kill these two saber cats on your own with your bare hands? If you are not here to grant me a good death, then you can leave. Um... Why do you wish to die? My time has come. I am old. Too old to become chief. It would be wrong for me to take wives at this age. So I will die. Malakath has given me a vision of a glorious death. I am to wait here until it finds me. As you can see, it has not yet arrived. You don't seem too old. Certainly you're still a strong, capable warrior. Indeed. One should find his death while he can still call himself a proper man. We orc men are not like these Nords and Imperials who carry on until they are gray and feeble and their hair falls out. To cling to something past its usefulness is unseemly. How much more so when that thing is you? Wow. Perhaps I could give you the death you seek. The death you seek. Perhaps. Are you sure about this? I think I should ask you that question. Hmm. We shall see. Come here. Ah, I want him to, like one shot me. Oh. 
Whoa, what just happened? If you are not here to grab Fight me, bro. Back, then you can leave. Perhaps. Are you sure about yes, this? Yes, I'm sure. Hmm. We shall see. I'm just afraid he's gonna one shot me. Tough old dude. It's really? Really? Man. Oh, my God. I want to give him a good death. Yeah. What a great death. And I'll take his gold. Falkreath is just down the hill. At least this time, guards won't instantly come after me and take my money. Or maybe they will. Whoa, who are you? What do you want? A courier for what? I've been looking for you. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. Let. Ah, a letter from the Jarl. Looks like that's it. Got to go. A letter from the Jarl, you say? Whoops. A Falkreath. I am pretty famous. Okay, let's go deal with this business and then it's end of the episode time. Who the hell are you? Oh, you Dawn Guard. The Dawn Guard is looking for anyone willing to fight against the growing vampire menace. What do you say? I say hell yeah. Ha. Huh. Ezron's going to like you. Go talk to him at Fort Dawnguard, southeast of Riften. He'll decide if you're Dawnguard material. Material. Did you see a dog out there? Huh? Did you see a dog out there? Nope, just wolves. Oh well. The blacksmith is offering a reward for a dog he saw on the road. I was hoping you'd seen it. I guess I'll stay on the lookout. Keep your nose clean while you're here, outsider. Oh, that's right. I'm level ten, aren't I? So I guess, um, oh yeah, return to journal. God damn, so much stuff to do. I guess this stage request has a level 10 prerequisite, and so does the Dawn Guard as well. And so does the mod mission thing I downloaded, um, level 10. It's called Worm's Tooth. I'm pretty sure I talked about it at the beginning of the Let's Play. You have only to stand in our cemetery. There you go. Thank you. It's a collection of regrets that I try not to forget. Here, I promised you this. Well, at least the gold reward was pretty hard. decent. Made it somewhat worth it. Now let's talk to Jarl Failface. Failius Maximus. Almost level 11 already. Sweet. In the next episode, I think I will craft some steel armor for Lydia. I'm pretty sure this house girl comes with steel armor as well. Hello! Yes, what is it that you want? I got your letter. I'm a messed. The total boss mage who's bossing everything up. Ah, it's you. Yeah. Yes, well, now we'll see if the stories about you are true. There's a group of bandits in oh, my hole. Oh, my God. I may have had a few discreet dealings with. The cut they were giving me was good at first, but 
Now. Now it's time to clean things up. Go and take care of it. It will be done. Good. Execute every last bandit. Spare no one. That's how I do it. What the hell are you doing, Lydia? I've got your back. Alright, how far away is this? No way in hell I'm doing it in this episode, but I'm just curious. Oh, yeah. Oh, I forgot he wanted this. Okay. Well, you know, I'm just going to end the episode here because it's been super mega long. Wow, Lydia, get out of the camera. So I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you all in the next one. Take care, everybody. Bye.